Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Python Flask. Today we are going to learn how to export the CSV in Python Flask. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. In the last two videos, what we have do, we have import the CSV data into the database. Now we are going to export that data. Okay. So with the MySQL, first one that is with the MySQL. So let me just copy this part section over here so here we have this one copy this section let me just whatever the code we have let me add this code over here and here we have let me shift it to the any other file okay so here we have to go with postgres anything we will put it over here and save this and here we have an untitled control a control x and here we are going to paste this code right and let's we are doing to just set this one okay so uh, mysql we have a root and the password is admin and uh, 123 hash and we have the test db i guess yes test db and we have to update the index dot file also because first off, we have to show the data. Then there is export button. We, we, when we click on the export, it will give me the CSV file of all the records that we have. So here we have an index file. So let me copy this index file over here. Okay. So here we go with the index file. Let's add it. Okay. And then we have another file that is users.html. So let's create the users.html where we have the listing okay so here we go with this one so let's copy and paste this part right save let's try to run this one code so here we go with python 3 i think it should be run okay so here we go with this one and uh, if you want to add the user you can add the user so here you can see that we have a 10 records let's add the name over here Rajni Khan, and let's add the email any email it's not coming yeah, it's coming let's add this user user added successfully let's go and check this one here go with the refresh 11 record is inserted let's go to the route of that one and here we have a view users you can see that we have a users then export to the csv when i do the export to the csv here you can see the file is opened with this one all the records 11 records of id name and the email so this is how we have done the export csv in the mysql let's understand the code first okay so here we go with first we will go with the main code that is app.py so here we have a flask we have to import from the flask that is render template request justify response then csv os i think i'm not using currently so mysql connector for the mysql database connectivity so first of all mysql configuration you have to go with that is look uh, so you you have the host username password and the database you have to put it over here next step connect to the mysql to the database so this is fire this is the connection so you have to pass the all the required details okay then with the help of cursor connection dot cursor will help you to connect to the database right then function to insert the data into the users table okay so there is a command that insert user okay so this will help you to just add the name and the email and the specific values then commit the connection okay function to fetch all the users so get all the users select all the users for this one because in the listing page we are showing all the users right so next we have export to csv so first of all we have to uh, write you we have to name which file then we are going to write all the data into that one write the headers and then write the data rows okay with the help of the csv writer we are going to start writing the data into the csv okay and in the index route we are going to render the index.html file and when we have the add users okay so it will give me the name email we have to insert the data into the database that users added successfully next we have a view users so so we are calling the get all users function where we have all the user record then we are going to render the template that is users.html with the users 
equal to users right so in the users.html here you can see that we are looping the users okay so we are fetching the user column user 0 1 and 2 okay so this is the for loops we have the id name and the email right so this is how and this is basically the css part the main thing that uh, we are doing over here like this one and then we have export to csv uh, anchor anchor tag so here on this function we are calling the export.csv where we are opening the users.csv right and writing the data into it so here you can see that get all users then we are calling the function over here and then response with the open users.csv with mime type that is text.csv headers with this attachment right and then at the last app.run file in the debug mode do it true okay so by doing all of this you are able i think index file i have discussed no then we will discuss that one also so here we have a form basically and where we have a name email so when i click on the add user add user it will go to the add function so here we have a slash add so here we have a add method so it it will go with the requesting this one and insert user it will insert the record into the database that's the this part okay so hope you understand how to export the csv in the mysql using python and the flask any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day